What's good YouTube? It's Brad from Their Cool Trainers back with another review today. I've got a shoe here that I promised to show you in the unboxing video I did last week and it is the Air Max Trophy Pack. Uh, you can see on the screen they're the £89 pair and then I got another £22 off and I got them and the Stan Smiths for under £120. They were actually on sale already at 5 points, 89 99 and then they did a Halloween sale. It was that long ago that I picked them up and um, you can see all the size tag there. That's the normal price, £120. And as I said, I got 25% off the sale price, which was £89.99. Which, if you've seen these in person, you know is an absolute steal. So, for the shoe itself, we've got that foil material that sort of changes to purple, blue, green, gold, yellow, depending on the light that hits it. And it goes all the way around the shoe, complemented by black wax laces black leather hits on the toe and around the heel and then um, you've got a white midsole with gold speckling it's very faint gold speckling it's not like um, monster work reflective or anything like that and then your black outsole there's another price um, sticker and then you've got infrared hits on the logos and the eyelets there as well hands down my favorite detail on the shoe is the reflective material around the upper I believe it was on most of the trophy pack, but um, the Air Max one was my personal favourite from the pack. It changes from greens to blues to yellows, obviously you, then they're all reflective. And then you've got your um, just premium materials used throughout the black leather and the waxed laces. It's just really cool touches and then there's also gold stitching which is another nod to sort of the World Cup and the trophy pack concept. And your infrared hits which are always nice on an um, Air Max. Uh, they really provide a nice contrast to the black and the reflective material as well. One minor de um, detail that I don't really like about this shoe is the speckled midsole. I never really like speckled midsoles on any shoes to be honest. Whenever I do an ID or I'm looking at Air Maxes, I never put the speckle on. In my personal opinion, it just makes the shoes sort of look dirty. And the other thing as well that um, is a minor disappointment is there's no special branding on the insoles or anything or on the packaging, it's just a normal sportswear box. Other than that though, the shoe overall is crazy, especially when you're considering that it's a sleeper shoe, not many people went crazy for it. It is a supreme release and it was a Crip Strike as well. So you would have thought with it being limited and with those two tags attached to it, it would have sold out in the day. But um, as I said, I got it for steel price and you can steal if you um, do some research and look around in the right places. When I um, first started looking for this shoe, it was because of a couple of YouTube reviews. I'll leave links to those videos down in the, um, down in the description below. Um, if you like this review, make sure to leave a like or a comment and even subscribe to my channel to see my other videos. Um, other than that guys, until next time, remember, they're called trainers. <laughs>